from Tehran to Texas, Iranian solar car gears up for U.S. race, but sanctions could prevent the vehicle arriving in time. With Iran planning to reduce its reliance on oil, work into solar power is gaining a foothold. And now one group of Iranian students is hoping to showcase their research by driving a solar-powered car through the American heartland. A 19-strong team is preparing to bring its Haven 2 car, which translates to Brilliant Sun, to compete in the American Solar Challenge in July. Powered by the sun, its 15FD, 4.5-meter, carbon fiber chassis resembles a giant door. The four wheels that lurk beneath its sprawling white body are the only clue it is a car at all. Last month, the flat, rectangular vehicle was tested alongside slightly larger gas-powered motor vehicles, on a stretch of highway in Iran's mountainous north. With final preparations now in place, the group plans to compete in an 8-day, 1,700-mile, 2,700-kilometer race that will take it from Austin, Texas to Minneapolis, Minnesota to have and to reach the top speed of 70 mph, 110 km per hour, during testing, but the team believes it is capable of 100 mph, 160 km per hour, in competition. Farhan Deynatsuri, 20, in charge of electronics on the project, from Gwazvanazad University near Tehran, said the team plan to optimize the car's absorption of solar energy based on the route it takes. We first do a simulation of the actual race course and study the weather conditions there. Then we try to calculate what the sun's angles would be during the eight days, she said. The 485 LB, 220 kilograms, Vehicle is 15FD, 4.5M, long, 6FD, 1.8M, wide, and 4FD, 1.1M, tall, with a cockpit, like canopy for the driver. With photovoltaic cells covering some 65 square feet, 6 square meters, of its surface, the car's lithium-ion batteries can drive it up to 4 hours. Located 100 miles, 160 kilometers, from the capital, Quasvin has 300 days of sunshine a year. Good roads stretch for miles across a largely barren desert landscape. To ensure a level playing field in the United States, all teams will rely on 516 photovoltaic panels, or solar cells, made in America and patched together in Germany. But each entrant has developed their own maximum power point tracking MPPD, system, which connects inverters, battery chargers, and other devices to optimize the car's performance. The skill and key to winning is understanding the course and detecting the angles of the sun's rays during a day's racing, starting at 9 a.m. and ending at 6 p.m. local time, with each team using four drivers.